गुड इवनिंग मिस्टर प्रशांत गुड इवनिंग सर एम आई एडिबल या 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 कंग्रेस मिस्टर प्रशांत सिंह फॉर सिलेक्टिंग ऑल इंडिया रैंक 7 इन इंजीनियर्स 2025 विद अ मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग स्ट्रीम ब्रीफली अबाउट योरसेल्फ मिस्टर प्रशांत सर माय नेम इज प्रशांत सिंह आई डिड आई डिड माय बीटेक इन मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग फ्रॉम ट्रिपल आईटी जबलपुर Okay. Then I joined uh, Steel Authority of India Limited Sale. There after, it, it, or, uh, it, it was through gate only. It was through gate sale. Uh -huh. Then after I joined NTPC as executive trainee through gate only. Uh -huh. uh, there after I joined Central Electricity Authority through Engineering uh -huh. Services 2023. 23. Yeah. And now uh -huh. currently working okay. as assistant director in Central Electricity uh -huh. Authority. Okay. Whether your training part is over? Uh, currently, or... currently I have, I have been posted to Delhi headquarters. Training uh -huh. is scheduled based on the batch, so uh -huh. our training will be soon scheduled. See, you are already working in railway, uh, ESC, uh, CEA, Central Electricity Authority. Electricity Authority. Yes. Sir. Why you have taken pain uh, again writing the IAS exam? Uh, sir i believe that uh, railway is a department which is going to provide huge opportunity for career development for personal okay. growth i believe that the opportunities that uh, the railway as an organization provide it is a huge and it is at a all india level so i do mm. believe that uh, the pain is worth the uh, success <clears throat> so railways is the motivating factor for you yeah <laughs> yes sir always okay so see when you faced the personal interview yes sir whether they asked this question already you are working yes sir okay. yes sir the same question was asked me in the interview as well ha uh, same answer you have given <laughs> yes sir okay so means uh, most of the questions are depending upon your work experience yes sir sir uh, since i uh, since i uh, worked in ntpc and steel authority of india these uh, are the core mechanical branches yes so the questions were framed according to my job profile only uh -huh. any questions on place of study place of birth etc uh, no I sir uh, most of the candidates who were already in jobs their question were targeted only on the job profile job profile hobbies questions on hobbies yes sir i have mentioned that i like to travel so they asked the question on traveling so how much time they have taken for your interview sir it was approximately about 20 to 25 minutes okay good time so yes, coming sir. to the prelims sir mr prashant yes sir uh, what was your strategy for uh, general studies part of prelims uh, sir since the general studies part is very dynamic paper and it has been changing throughout the recent years so mm -hmm. i tried to focus on the notes first of all i did go through all my notes then i tried to try to improve my accuracy by attempting all the mock tests uh -huh. so i was very sure that only mock tests are going to be helpful for my preparations uh -huh. i tried to solve as many as mock tests because the main part of the gs portion is you have to guess the most appropriate answer correct because correct. no one 100% definitely knows that this is going to be the correct answer so uh -huh. i tried to improve my guess work and my smart work by attempting the mock tests so i think uh, our yes online test series helped you a lot yes sir i i applied for the engineering prelims test series then uh -huh. i appeared in the mains test series as well okay. and moreover i applied moreover i solved all the past two year questions since as has been uh -huh. providing two years mock yeah. tests so i uh -huh. did complete all my two years Uh, oh, what about the PYQs of uh, GATE and IES? PYQs, the PYQs are one. Uh, we can say that these are the holy bible for cracking the examinations. I did okay. attempt all the PYQs multiple times, and uh. I I did go through all the questions, star marked all the relevant question and more most important questions as well. Okay, okay. So coming to the technical paper, one fifty yes. questions. Yes, sir. Ah, uh, three hundred marks. Okay. Yes, sir. Ah, uh, whether uh, time was a constraint in solving the paper? Sir, I did practice a lot of mock tests, so my main concern was the accuracy, not the time accuracy. constraint. Oh. Okay. Because 
the paper was a little bit on the easier side this year so i had to maintain my accuracy in the prelims paper because that was going sir, to be very crucial which subjects are easy to score in prelims in mechanics sir i believe that my stronger area would be paper 1 that includes thermodynamics rse power plant and other subjects okay so have you prepared simultaneously for prelims and mains of the technical subjects sir uh, at the starting of my preparation i tried the holistic approach i tried to solve the prelims question as well as the mains questions hmm. but before 2 3 months i stopped all the mains questions and solely focused on the prelims question that multiple hmm. choice question only okay so one general question i'll ask see most yeah. of the rankers this year in engineers 2025 are yes. already working for some yes. organization ei esc yes sir so it may demotivate the btech pursuing students or just to pass out students yes How sir, you sir. Say that these this year i do believe that the, uh, the competition was on the higher yeah. side because most of the candidates who were appearing were already yeah. selected this already is mainly selected. due is to is it not a demotivating factor for freshers Uh, sir uh, this is only due to because of the lack of vacancies throughout the years railway has been yeah, introduced railways, after 5 to 6 year mm. so i don't think so that next year is going to be the same scenario yeah yeah good good point next year this problem may not be there the, yeah. next year definitely this problem won't be there mm. uh, do you think that uh, a btech final year student uh, can crack ias in the first attempt yes sir for sure What there has been condition? there has been multiple instances where people do have cracked it uh i on my side suggest that if you are thorough with your subjects and you have your concepts clear mm. it is going to be very easy task for a final year student as mm. long as he can balance his studies college studies and mm. his preparation okay so you which is the recommended year for a btech students to start preparation for ies esc exam or get sir uh, you have you uh, the the student can generally start parallelly along with the third year because okay. in third year there are core subjects in their curriculum as well mm -hmm. so try to focus on the core subjects and in final year based on the syllabus of gate and esc you go through all the extra subjects that are mentioned in the syllabus so i do believe that final year student can easily prepare for this exam what about micro notes or short notes sir i used to make little bit of short notes but i mainly focused on the mistakes that i did on my test series so i okay. used to prepare notes only on the questions that were marked wrong in my test series so i also prepared the short notes for the mains test as well because i needed to go through all the critical points where i was making mistakes so i have a huge notebook of my mistakes so can i call it as mistake notes yes sir for sure sir these are going to be more beneficial than the short notes okay uh, okay mr prashant ji congratulations once again pranams to your uh, parents okay god bless you beta thank, thank you sir thank you sir thank you sir